what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? A black woman, Peace Bazari, was kidnapped and put up for sale on Facebook by a Lebanese man. You hear me right, fam? Who is this super dummy? International clown. Will Yero is his name. Will Yero. Straight up clown. This fool posted her passport, a picture of her passport, on Facebook and said, buy and sell in Lebanon. So what's the going rate for a human being these days? 100,000, 50,000, 40,000, 20, 10,000? Try $1,000, fam. This clown was trying to sell a whole human being for $1,000 on Facebook, like it was some sort of e-commerce transaction and the internet went to work on his ass. The post went viral. The police got wind of it, swooped in, made the arrest and rescued peace. It's not clear how she was kidnapped in Lebanon, but peace is from Nigeria. Police say that up until yesterday, she was being held in Lebanon because of COVID-19. Family, I can only speculate, but they didn't mention that she had any accomplices. She didn't have anybody with her, any family or whatever. So I can only assume that she just went out there by herself, perhaps for a vacation or something, perhaps business, whatever. Bad idea. I had to stop my goddaughter from traveling by herself recently to a foreign place. It's not a good idea. I know that everybody, you know, I hear people saying all the time, well, you know, I don't want to live in fear. I don't want to live in fear. You know, the world is dangerous. If something's going to happen, it's going to happen. Not necessarily. There are some things that you can do to rush it. Like, perhaps a train is coming. You try to beat the train. Was it your time or did you rush it? People die of cancer all the time. But if you smoke five packs a day and you die of cancer at 40? Was it your time or did you rush it? Let's say you stole 100 keys from a drug lord, bumped into his mom at the grocery store and slapped her, then said, I don't give a damn about your son. Tell him it's whatever. And you got yourself killed. Was it your time or did you rush it? I understand we got these free spirits out there and you know, and you don't want to live in fear, but you have to take precautions. There are people out there who make a living on preying on women who are alone, especially. One little move, bam, you're sold into slavery. You're sold into sex trafficking. You out of here. It's easier than you think. And some of the most vigilant women have fallen victim. And that's the real scary part. So, if that's the case, then let this serve as a warning. Be very careful out there, fam. Watch yourself. And this dude, Will, Gerald, oh man. 
Your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the haters talking about?